Wayne police are investigating the deaths of three people in what they're calling a double murder-suicide. That incident started late last night. News Channel 15's Chris Darby is live this morning where it all came to an end hours later. Chris? Good morning, guys. Yeah, I'm in the 900 block of Pemberton Drive. That's just north of the Maumee River, east of downtown. Right now, police are still here guarding the spot where the third person was found dead around 2 o'clock this morning. Now, this whole incident started around 9 o'clock last night. Someone called 911 and said there was a shooting on Pemberton. When officers got here, they found an SUV with bullet holes in the middle of the street. Police tell News Channel 15 two female victims in their late teens or early 20s were found shot in a yard a block to the west on Kensington Boulevard. One of the victims was dead. The other was taken to the hospital but was pronounced dead there. Officers were then led to believe the suspect was in a home near where the shooting happened. The emergency service and crisis response teams were called in to try to coax the man out of the house. After two hours without a response, officers made their way into the home. They found the man dead inside. Police say it appears he shot himself. An autopsy will be completed on everybody involved to determine cause and manners of death. And then they'll keep trying to do a back investigation to figure out why, why this happened. Part of that back investigation the officer is referring to there includes taking a close look at social media. According to police, the victims were involved in some sort of conversation online, and that may help paint a better picture of what happened here. Now, we should find out the names of the victims in the next couple of days. Of course, we'll update that and bring it to you right here on First News when we get that. Reporting live on Pemberton Drive this morning, Chris Darby, News Channel 15.